Hello and welcome to our viewers here in the United States and around the world. Thanks for joining us for what is a defining moment in Hyundai's history. Today, we are excited to introduce the model year 2022 all-new Tucson to the US market. This new Tucson is more than a model year rebuild. It is part of Hyundai's commitment to introduce 12 new or significantly enhanced SUVs by the end of next year, including the completely refreshed Santa Fe and new Santa Fe calligraphy luxury trim. Some are being designed and built right here in the United States at our plant in Montgomery, Alabama. With the Tucson and the impressive lineup of 12 new models to come, I am confident we will add excitement to the brand and earn even more SUV customers. These 12 new models will also play a major role in helping us meet the Hyundai Motor Group's electrification goal of selling 1 million EVs by 2025. There are a lot of exciting things happening at Hyundai. Today, it is the all-new Tucson, but stay tuned because there is a lot more to come. Now, I don't have to tell any of you what a challenging year this has been for everyone around the world. If you would have told me in January that we would be gripped by multiple waves of global pandemic, I wouldn't have believed you. At Hyundai America, we were fortunate that our parent company, Hyundai Motor Company, provided support for South Korea's phenomenal response to the COVID-19 outbreak. Our operations in the US benefited directly from the best practices we learned and adopted from our colleagues in Korea. Over the past year, Hyundai America has taken extraordinary steps to support its customers, employees and dealers during this difficult time. In March, we quickly transitioned headquarters staff in California to work from home. At our plant in Alabama, we deployed safety measures to protect our team members. We reassessed our production strategy to avoid the supply problems other manufacturers faced. And as a result, we succeeded in retaining all of our employees plus their benefits while keeping them healthy. We also reached beyond our workforce to support customers facing financial hardship. We reinitiated our job loss assurance program and became the first auto manufacturer to provide payment deferrals for new and existing customers. We put our clean assurance program in place to protect the health of customers and employees at our dealerships. And we accelerated our digital retailing program so customers can shop and buy online with confidence and have the car delivered right to their home. And thanks to our leadership in Seoul, Hyundai new COVID-19 testing was key to managing this deadly virus. So in late March, Hyundai Hopo Wheels launched an initiative to expand COVID-19 testing in communities hard hit by the virus. To date, Oppo Wheels has donated over $4.4 million to fund 23 testing sites nationwide and enabled more than 1 million COVID-19 tests. I am extremely proud of our ongoing efforts of combating this global pandemic. And we all hope for better days soon. At Hyundai, our global mission is progress for humanity. We are working toward that goal through our commitments to our local communities and investing in the mobility solutions of the future, including hydrogen, fuel cells, and urban air mobility. We are pushing boundaries across our enterprise. Our entire lineup is designed around our customer and the future. We have accelerated our efforts and our competitors have noticed. We've set new industry standards in quality, safety, and design. Our products are appealing to younger and more diverse customers with active, creative, and fun lives that are fully engaged with the world around them. You've seen it in our latest cars, Sonata and Elantra, where we have adapted a strategy 
to ignite customers' imagination. We are also bringing cutting-edge design to our growing SUV lineup. Our all-new Tucson is a perfect example. In the 16 years since it was first introduced, Tucson has become one of the brightest stars in Hyundai's universe. It is our best-selling SUV and one of our leading models overall. I am pleased to say that this past April we reached an impressive milestone. We sold our one millionth Tucson here in the US. With the dramatic changes in the fourth generation Tucson, we know the all new Tucson will be a clear and compelling choice in a crowded segment. Tucson is a great expression of our deep commitment to customers. And in designing this innovative new model, we put their input first. We wanted to build on the versatility, roominess and performance that loyal Tucson owners have come to love over the years. So we spoke with owners across the country to hear which features they value the most. Here is some of what we heard. What I like best is the, the versatility that it has. Uh, it's just capable of so much more than what it appears to be. I, I definitely like the fact that I don't have to worry if I have the right car for the circumstance. Go to the beach, go camping, go to the coffee shop, you know, that's what I like. I like that the car matches whatever I want to do. I need a lot of things for work and it is able to fit the things I need as well as my big family. I like the gas mileage in the Tucson and I like the fact that it had blind spot detection. Once I realized all the features that were in it and, and the capabilities that were in it, yeah, that's definitely, it's just, it was perfect. Two things, uh, one is I, I just need this much more space and then the other thing is just uh, integration with just technology nowadays. I would like for it to be um, more cargo space and an automatic start, that would be great. We want to thank our customers for helping us deliver the exciting new Tucson we are bringing you today. It reimagines and advances our best-selling SUV to offer a driving and ownership experience like no other. Now sit back and relax as we embark on a digital journey to learn more about the boldest, most innovative Tucson ever. Hello, my name is Sangya Pli. America is the heart of the SUV market. Once exciting, confident, and adventurous, we feel it has become overcrowded. As a designer, I had to ask myself, what can we do to move the game forward? We did not want the Tucson to become another SUV. We want it to be a design icon. So, what type of design value did we want to deliver? In designing the fourth generation Tucson, we chose on travel path, rather than following the trend out there. Simply put the most dynamic SUV ever. How do we tackle such a challenge? Where would we start? We began with our unique design philosophy, sensuous sportiness. A philosophy that gives us the way to challenge the status quo with innovative engineering solutions to realize unprecedented new level of design. We started with Hyundai's unique lighting architecture, using digital tools to create a design so distinctive and iconic that the lights alone identify the car. Imagine driving at night and seeing these lights in your rearview mirror. Pretty cool, isn't it? We call this integrated architecture. The lights are seamlessly integrated into the parametric jewel grille and are completely invisible when turned off. 
the design continues in the overall proportion. Long hood, level roof, and short overhangs combine with a stretched wheelbase to give the Tucson a strong foundation. They're robust and energetic. With chisel jewel-like surfaces that create a very unique body side, we call this parametric dynamics. Notice how the chrome line above the yellow gets gradually thicker towards the rear, almost like an arrow flying in an arc trajectory. It helps visually to push the car down, make it feel lower, and complementing the Tucson's overall wedge shape. The rear of the chrome line that merges into edge of the rear spoiler. And the rear wipers move up and hide under the spoiler, creating the super clean surface over the rear window. We integrated the Hyundai logo underneath of the glass to help minimize unnecessary dead space in the tailgate area. And accented the striking full width tail lamp with highly detailed hidden lights to complete exteriors parametric theme. Inside the Tucson, the design theme is interspace where space, technology, and information organically intersect. Here we create a layered, naturally flowing layout to reflect seamless user experience we built into the cabin. In order to create an open air environment, we dropped the instrument display downward with a completely flat upper surface that emphasizes a wide field of view and hidden vents that perfectly blends into the interior design almost like an airplane cabin. Our design team follow the untraveled path facing unprecedented engineering challenges to push for the design innovation. It is about creating our own design values that are offering a fresh, transformative experience for our customer. The all-new Tucson, the best-selling Hyundai SUV. It is a pioneer, not just for us, but for the segment. And now, it is time to move forward on your journey and learn more about our exciting new Tucson. Thank you very much. Hello. Hyundai has a significant investment in North America, and it is all designed to meet customer needs in the world's largest automobile market. In product planning, we listened carefully to those needs, and we worked to deliver what those customers wanted. In the U.S., customers prefer larger SUVs. So for the U.S. market, we made the Tucson bigger and more substantial. As Sang Yup explained, we stretched the wheelbase and lengthened the body. We also widened the cabin and made it taller to improve roominess and deliver that class-leading rear legroom. We increased the new Tucson's cargo volume nearly 25% to 38.7 cubic feet and we gave it a versatile layout so that our customers can configure the vehicle for a wide variety of loads. Our goals were to maintain the Tucson's popularity and expand its reach, while giving customers this more dynamic driving experience. So besides packaging, we listened to U.S. customer needs in our powertrain selection, and we chose a compelling combination of value efficiency, and performance. Customers can select from three different smart stream engines. There's a gas, a hybrid, and a plug-in hybrid. 
The gas version features a new 2.5 liter direct injected four cylinder engine with 187 horsepower. We coupled this new engine with an eight speed automatic transmission. So we wanted to maximize both efficiency and acceleration. With the front wheel drive powertrain, fuel economy is nearly 25% better than the current Tucson. The new hybrid features a 1.6 liter turbocharged engine that's 30% more efficient than the gas engine. Coupled with this powerful electric motor, the hybrid generates over 20% more torque. It's wicked fun to drive every day. And it can travel over 500 miles on a single fill-up. The plug-in hybrid has even more kick thanks to its larger 13.8 kilowatt hour battery. It targets an all electric range of 28 miles and over 70 MPGE. The Tucson Hybrid will have class leading horsepower, standard H-Track all wheel drive, and a smooth hybrid tuned six speed automatic transmission. It's gonna be quiet, gonna be efficient. Both electrified versions also introduce this new feature that we call e-handling. It applies torque control from the electric motor to improve that cornering performance and provide that fun to drive, driving dynamic. We tested the three new Tucsons at our proving grounds in the Mojave Desert. We ran them through every kind of road condition because we wanted to evaluate the durability, the handling, the noise, vibration, harshness, and heat protection. We tested our H-Track all-wheel drive to maximize Tucson's footing on all sorts of different surfaces. And then we spent time to fine tune the suspension. It's really critical that you dial in the optimum balance of responsiveness, comfort, and handling. To make sure that Tucson meets the highest safety standards, at Hyundai, safety is paramount. We ran extensive crash tests to target NHTSA 5 Star and IIHS top safety pick bus ratings. We gave Tucson's more standard and available active safety features than any other SUV in its class. Because it's important to us that we keep drivers passengers, and other road users out of harm's way. This new Tucson is on point. It is built to surprise and delight Tucson fans and new customers across the U.S. And for buyers looking for an equally fun to drive, sportier looking Tucson, I'm excited to say that we have an N-Line version coming later next year. Along with Tucson's new powertrains, the dynamic performance, and enhanced safety, the customers are gonna find this rich array of comfort and convenience features that set Tucson apart from the crowd. But hey, don't just take it from me. Find out what a Tucson fan likes the most about our next generation model. Safe travels. I'm Sage. Along with being a pro surfer, I'm what Hyundai calls a creative connector and I'm always on the go. When I'm not in the water, I'm posting my stories and getting the word out to my fans. I've been partnering with Hyundai for close to two years now and I'm currently driving a Palisade and I totally love it. Some of my friends and family also have Hyundais and they love them too. Last summer, Hyundai loaned me a Tucson to drive during the US Open. What a great car and it sure brought me luck. Now I can't wait to get behind the wheel of this all new Tucson. Want to see how I'd use it? I'd started up on a cold winter morning, 
and warm the driver's seat from my cozy little kitchen. When I use the digital key, it knows who I am and remembers my preferences. Even my favorite music and navigation destinations. I'm ready to go. I'd use every bit of the Tucson's larger cargo space. I can get two more boards in there. Yeah, I haul a ridiculous amount of gear. Of course, Smart Park will come in handy. Some of these folks know how to ride a wave, but park a car, not so much. Did I mention that this car can see stuff that you can't? I have absolutely no idea how that works. And that it keeps you centered and cruising along at the speed limit. A big plus on an epic day trip. It keeps everybody on the road safe. Me, my passenger, my dogs, that guy. And I love that I can stay connected and charging. Don't you love this screen? It's huge. And I really need Tucson's all-wheel drive. That's a given. So I'm pretty sure I know what my next Hyundai will be. This bad boy right here. It has a style, all its own. It can handle everything I do and take me anywhere I want to go. Whether it's exploring, enjoying the outdoors and camping, a day on the slope snowboarding, or just cruising with my friends for a night on the town. I can really see myself in the all new Tucson. I sure hope Hyundai can. Now let's catch one last wave back to where we started. See you at the beach. Welcome back. We have taken you on quite an adventure. I hope you enjoyed the ride and share our enthusiasm about this bold new Tucson. I want to sincerely thank Sage, BC and Sanyup for their contributions to our story. As part of Hyundai's significant investment in the North American automobile market, I'm pleased to say that the all new Tucson will be proudly made in the USA where it will continue to provide good jobs to the people of Alabama and suppliers across the country. Look for it this coming spring. I'm also excited to tell you that the Tucson N-Line you heard about earlier is one of seven new N-Brand vehicles that we will bring to market in the next two years. The group includes an all new Elantra N that is sure to capture the attention of performance-minded customers. We will provide more details in the months ahead. In the meantime, I invite you to learn more about the revolutionary new Tucson and our entire lineup of SUVs at Hyundai.com. And with that, we conclude our digital premiere. I want to thank all of you who join in across the country and around the world for today's landmark announcement. We cannot wait to bring our newest products to market and continue to make things better for our customers. From all of us at Hyundai Motor America, we wish you good health and safe travels wherever you go.
am a sad world, there ain't no stopping me. You'll see me blaze a trail to the Milky Way. I told you, world, there ain't no stopping me. Step aside, world, there ain't no stopping me.